In Salesforce Lightning, uh, you have a couple different type of list views that you can view. So uh, right here, we're on opportunities and we're looking at a standard list view. If I come over here to this chart looking button and click down, I'll see that I also have the Kanban or Kanban uh, view available. Now, if I click this, you see that it's separated everything into cards in columns with our stages. So these cards are actually, you know, drag and drop so I can update records on the fly. Now, validation rules will still apply to this. So if I'm trying to update a record or move something somewhere and uh, perhaps maybe I'm missing a field that's required due to validation, it will cause an error and it'll pop, gen you know, generate that error for you. Um, so this won't allow you to skip any process that you actually have to fulfill that'll still fire. So when I'm in a Kanban view, I can also click the gear here and go to settings. And you can see that I have uh, a summarize by and then a group by pick list here. So in the summarize area for opportunities, I only have two fields that I can summarize by for now. And that's amount and expected revenue. This could change based on maybe custom fields that you have available um, in your organization. For this example, we only have two fields that are able to be summarized. But if I go to group by, I can see that I have opportunity owners, lead sources, really anything that's a um, kind of sortable field here, you're gonna be seeing in the group by. And if I go to select fields to display, similar to a standard list view, I can also move these fields around. Now Kanban, the first four fields on this list are the ones that are going to appear on the card. As you can see here, I have opportunity name, account name, stage and close date. Maybe I wanna get rid of account name and move amount into our top four. Now when I do this, you can see that the amount is now shifted into our card and it's only showing four fields. Um, one of the other things that you'll see here is the yellow kind of alert signal. Now this just means that there's no open activities on this record. Um, so if I wanted to add an activity straight from the Kanban, I can hover over this and actually add a new task right from this window. Similar to the other list view, I can click charts and everything like that and filters will work the exact same way as they would on a standard list. Um, so Features and functionality on the top mostly stay the same. The difference is the ability to drag and drop um, as well as um, sort and summarize. Now, if I click this button and I hit edit, similar to our other list view, I'm also able to pop open this page and edit the actual record and see all of its field from here as well.